Hi, I'm Dr. Kristen Sumners, family medicine physician for Holland Hospital in Zealand. I am going to talk to you today about high blood pressure, also known as hypertension. High blood pressure is when there is an increase in the pressure in the arteries or vessels that carry blood from your heart to the rest of your body. Hypertension accounts for one of the most common medical visits in the United States, something that we see commonly almost every day in the office. There are multiple risk factors that increases a person's chance of developing hypertension or high blood pressure. Those can include increasing age, obesity or lack of physical activity, family history, diet high in sodium, more than three grams a day, tobacco abuse, excessive alcohol use. So other risk factors can include prescription medications such as birth control pills or even over-the-counter medications like anti-inflammatories such as Motrin or Aleve. Illicit drug use is another common cause of high blood pressure. Chronic underlying medical conditions such as thyroid disorder, kidney disease, and obstructive sleep apnea also increases a person's risk of developing high blood pressure. It is important to talk to your physician to understand your risk for hypertension because untreated high blood pressure can lead to complications including chronic kidney disease, heart attack, stroke, and even enlargement of the heart called left ventricular hypertrophy. Symptoms of high blood pressure are very variable. Most often it is asymptomatic, meaning you don't have any symptoms and it is something that is picked up when you go to see your doctor. That's why it is very important to see your physician for routine health maintenance. More severe symptoms of uncontrolled blood pressure could present as headache, vision changes, dizziness, and in very severe cases, chest pain or shortness of breath. Of course, if you were to have any of the severe symptoms listed, you should talk to your physician immediately or present to the ER for evaluation. If you and your physician determine that you have high blood pressure, you will then speak to them about the appropriate course of treatment. Treatment may include medications, but it is also important to talk with your physician about things you can do to lower your blood pressure. That would include regular physical activity in obtaining an optimal body weight, a diet that is high in fresh fruits and vegetables and low in sodium, avoiding tobacco, and avoiding excessive alcohol. If you have concerns about high blood pressure or hypertension or are overdue for your routine health maintenance, please call our office today for an appointment.